if we can check the DNA of Gordon Obasake, what we see in that DNA is betrayal, serial betrayal, and ungratefulness. The DNA of Obasake is what? Betrayer, serial betrayer, and ungratefulness. Let me stand today to apologize to Adam Soshimole, who has been vindicated by telling us that we will see the true color, we will see the insincerity, we will see the ungratefulness of Governor Obasaki. So let me apologize to Adam Soshimole and to say you have been vindicated. You're right. We were wrong. I've never seen people who are so ungrateful in life. I've never seen people who can betray everything in life. Never speak the truth. I will never betray any man. Ask Governor Basaki, has he done anything for PDP? Has he voted for PDP? The only election he voted was his own election when we gave him umbrella. So who has more stake in PDP? I have more stake. Because I have supported PDP always. You have never supported PDP. Rather, it was when your godfather chased you away and you came begging, kneeling down. People came with pressure and we allowed you. Ordinarily, you're a tenant. Ordinarily. Ordinarily. Now, I already said Nigerian leadership, not bullies. No problem about that. You came to beg a bully for you to have a ticket. A bully was a DG campaign, and the bully bullied you into a government house. You came to beg a bully. A bully was a DG campaign. A bully bullied you into a government uh, house. What a shame. It did not only end that you came back with your wife to thank the bully. That after God, the bully made it possible for you to be there. What is the problem in a dust state? And people may not know. I will always stand by the truth and nothing by the truth. I will never stand and support injustice. If everybody wants to support injustice, I will not support injustice. I will not support impunity. A man came when he was disqualified for certain irregularities, certificate, and this and that and that, by his godfather, Oshimuri. The whole world, people were calling, help. He never allowed the bully to sleep. He was coming to the bully. Bully, please help me. Bully, please help me. Let me have to get. Haba. He came with uh, governors. And let me tell you, Obaseke, I know your cohorts. I will smoke all of you out. <laughs> Go and ask people. This is not the Benin artifact where you are challenging the Oba, which you lost woefully. This is, this is politics. Abbasake, I have more stake in PDP than you. I have fought for this party. Mention one thing you have done for PDP. One, 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 one. All the elections who have run, no contribution. If you ask him, he said he didn't know. The only thing he knows is about his own uh, interest. A party has done congresses broad party structure, you came. I will tell the party structure to support you. And they supported you. The Zona chairman was campaign manager, Chief Dan Obey. Under the COVID, he, he, COVID affected him. And we have to take him out. You remember the song sang by Dan Obey? People should not be ungrateful in life. People should not be. People say you are a betrayer. Sometimes you hold yourself. Say, look, these people are saying, I think it's not the best for me. 
Let one person mention that I'm a betrayer. Let one person say, I'm not supportive of this party. So how can a tenant come and tell me he, he was a, a, a interest? Who did tell you? You are meeting with APC every day. I don't need, if I'm contending for president, with due respect, I'm qualified, very qualified, if not more than qualified. I challenge the Masaka and his cohorts, some of the presidential aspirants, who are using him to talk, whatever, they should come out openly. If I decide to run tomorrow, I challenge anybody. I challenge anybody, including the so-called Obaseke. What you will see, you will say, look, you never knew this is how politics is. So don't be, wor don't, don't be worried about whether I want to run the presidential election. If I want to run, you, you can't give me permission. I gave you the seat, so I can give me permission. I will win. Tell your presidential aspirants who are sending you. The Supreme, I don't come out. If I come out, I will win them.